Right then, let's talk about miniature versions of well-known products. Let's start off with the mini pointer dart. The regular pointer dart, it comes in different lengths and it's a very regular sort of bus. But then you get the miniature version. And on the small version, it's got the same width, the same height and the same sort of spaciousness to the inside. But the whole thing is shorter. And that's the only difference because everything else runs just as expected. In fact, I'd actually say the mini pointer dart runs even better than the main pointer dart because it's still got the same sort of engines running on a much smaller bus that so really excel accelerates quick. Plus, look how close together the front wheel and back wheel are. Because of how close those wheels are, it can whiz around corners crazy quick. Back in the day in Redway, like this doesn't happen anymore because things are more regulated now, but back in like the 2000s, drivers used to go absolutely crazy on these little buses and whiz them around corners. It was like a really fun roller coaster ride. And that shows that miniature versions of products can often be really fun. The next product I want to talk about is the baby bus. So with Airbus, you get the Airbus A320 which is a very standard sort of airplane. It's the usual sort of airplane that the cheap flight operators use. There's also the long version, the A321, which is the same thing but longer. There's also the short version, the A319, which is used by EasyJet to fly to places with short runways, such as Gibraltar. But there's an even shorter Airbus, the Airbus A318. It's the same width, it's still three by three seats across, so it's got the same sort of dial to the interior, but it is shorter. It is crazy short. And the fact it's such a short plane, but in the same size body, it's a much bigger plane gives it a very weird miniature look to it it looks like a really fun plane sadly i've not been on one because they don't run on the cheap flights but let's now move on to the product in the title of the video which is the baby disc another classic example of a regular product made miniature and the thing is about all three of these products i've just talked about it's not simply taking the product and shrinking the whole thing because what's happened is the actual overall product itself is smaller but on the mini pointer dart the air Airbus A318 and the baby disc, the actual components behind these products are the same as the big versions. Meaning you get a smaller product running on the same proper big equipment as the regular version of a product. Meaning that these miniature versions of a product are actually over-engineered and they're really nice. So I have done a previous video of a detailed look at the cone baby disc. But on this video, I found a first generation version, an older version of the classic old cone eco disc buttons. This is a very interesting original cone MX05 eco disc. Let's ride it. Well, how many clunk on this? Hmm. <laughs> it's on top of my lip. And let's now surf it. Fuck that small. It's tidy. Run the inspection up. Thank you. 
broken on this trip. I didn't just find the one baby. This I found a second one. But this one's the later build with the later eco disc fixtures. Let's also take a look at this one. Got these more clicky buttons again. Feel that. Yeah, we can all fit in it. Just. And let's surf it. <laughs> Baby disc. It's got a high quality roller, not a cheapest roller. Look at the door. Look, there he goes. it's going down. It's relevelling, relevelling. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 